We are about seven months in and just under 63% of households in Alabama have completed the census. The numbers are better in Madison County though. Over 75% of households have filled it out. But census officials say we can still do better. We're really encouraged to see so many people responding so far. In Huntsville, you're at about 72% of people have responded on their own to the census, but we're really trying to encourage and get everyone up to that 100% completion. Population size affects how many congressional seats each state gets. Alabama is at risk of losing representation if we do not get an accurate count in the census. The census also determines how billions of dollars in federal funding is distributed each year. The funding goes toward things like local health clinics, education grants, and other programs. It is just so important for our critical services like emergency preparedness, emergency services we're seeing so important right now uh, given them pandemic uh, from and to things like school uh, lunch programs as well it's just so important for a multitude of critical resources that Alabama relies on it takes about 10 minutes to fill out you can do it online by mail or by phone if none of those options work for you we do have census takers coming to your door to help you fill out the census uh, all of our census takers are trained to wear a mask they will also practice social distancing when they conduct the short interview. For more information and how to fill out the census, just head to rocketcitynow.com. Putting the Valley first, Kelly Kennedy, WZDX News.